Hello guys, this is Lauren. How are you? And uh, it's been a long time since uh, my last upload. And uh, today I have a. Uh, for me, it's very interesting because it's my first time to do this. So I'm going to bake a uh, ube pandesal today because I got this one in a uh, Asia store this one Ubenis. so this is like food color and essence in one so yeah let's try it here's a short video of the pandesal guys if you if you like my channel uh, please subscribe and uh, yeah um, share with your uh, friends or in your Facebook accounts so um, before I uh, before I, I continue I just want to make an announcement that uh, every Friday I'm going to to make a live stream um, live music with uh, my uh, with my team uh, Francis Ting MB and uh, Kuya Ed uh, Abrenica or Ed Connect so sometimes uh, Trisha 999 is there and uh, uh, JV88 is there so they are my team we are all five Voltes five <laughs> so please connect with them also okay guys um at the end of this video maybe it's a taste test so here it is so guys here are the ube pandesal they smell so good um if you want me to do a video about how to do the ube pandesal please let me know please comment down below and i'm going to do a video how to do the ube pandesal for you so the next is so guys now i'm going to make the mascarpone ube filling um but if you like if you don't have uh, mascarpone in your area you can also use uh, cream cheese for uh, this this is a very easy and yummy delicious uh, filling um, you can uh, use it as a filling of cake and whatever you like this is a universal filling yumminess so what I'm going to do is uh, put sugar into this uh, mascarpone cream this is uh, maybe I'm gonna put three tablespoons only so that it will not gonna be so sweet so just like that and uh, I'm going to mix that sugar with the ube ubenes ubenes so this is a food color and um, essence together in one so I'm gonna put three a cups or yeah let's see I'm going to try first um, two cups or bottle cups if it is work like that So here is it. it is. Um, if you have powder sugar, maybe it's better to put powder sugar so the sh so that the sugar will going to mix well. Uh, but I don't have uh, powder sugar right now. That's why I use the um, medium brown sugar. But uh, I think uh, brown cane sugar is uh, more. Uh, it's not too healthy but uh, it's a little bit healthy at least so yeah, just mix together like this I'm gonna I'm not going to fast forward this video 
because it's uh, just a uh, short video just like that mm, let's smell it mm, not yet smell like ube then I'm going to put another uh, bottle cup um, I found this uh, ube essence in Asia store for the first time because I'm, I'm looking for the ube gem from the Philippines but uh, they don't have it because uh, I think um, uh, I don't know maybe it's uh, it's not easy to to import things right now so that's why they don't have ube, ube jam my children love the ube jam so but uh, and then I was searching for a ube powder but still they don't have it and then uh, but I'm so thankful that uh, they have the ubeness or the ube essence food color and yeah now I have ubeness I can do anything with ube later watch out for the recipe of uh, my uh, fake halaya so this is now the mascarpone ube mm. tastes good so yeah mix mix together mix well together so that uh, the sugar and the food color or essence will go into um, incorporate so close the bottle and then uh, what I'm going to do is uh, put this in in a uh, bottle jar because mascarpone must in the refrigerator or else they will become soggy or watery because uh, remember this is a cheese and uh, yeah it's a cream cheese Italian cream cheese but I as I have said uh, you can use uh, other kind of cream cheese so put in a jar because my kids will gonna love it my husband also will gonna love it because uh, this is very delicious um, you can do this also you can put this filling uh, on the top of muffins or a filling for cakes and everything you like or in a cracker it's a very universal uh, filling and you will love it so I'm going to put the rubber just like that and the top of it and there's a clip here just like that so it's finished and ready for the refrigerator and the rest will gonna be for my pandesal ube taste test so it's not the the rest is not too much but uh, it's uh, it's enough for the ube pandesal taste test so uh, Please watch for the the ube pandesal taste test, and uh, you will going to ask me how to make ube pandesal. <laughs> and uh, here are the pandesal. I have four here. 
the two pieces will going to be the breakfast of my husband and uh, so guys let's uh, continue with the taste test the pandesal it's already it's already cold guys <laughs> and uh, yeah I have here pandesal and uh, the mascarpone that I uh, did before this is only the rest of the mascarpone so and I have here pandesal self-made pandesal it look like this so and uh, let's taste this the pandesal with ube mascarpone filling but you know guys you if you don't have mas mascarpone in your area you can also use um, cream cheese so guys but um, if you all also like uh, me to do a live uh, live cooking or cook baking um, please let me know please comment down below and uh, I'm gonna do it for you mm. Mm. that's so yummy guys believe me that's why if you like the recipe if you like me to do the recipe the whole recipe of the pandesal uh, ube pandesal please let me know and uh, we can do it or who wants to collab collaborate with me um, baking a pandesal please let me know and let's bake together please comment down below and uh, yeah let's do baking collaboration baking or anything you want we can do collaboration cooking or something like that I'm willing to so guys uh, thank you very much for watching please comment down below really I, I will I will appreciate if you if you like to, to collaborate with me baking uh, uh, live stream please let me know so guys thank you very much for watching i love you all and god bless you all take care everyone this is lauren bye, -bye.